If you want to know the best adventure TV shows, you should definitely watch our picks for the best ones of 2021. I think you have the wrong guy, officer. Are we reporting this? We hope you will enjoy the following ranking. Please let us know your favorite in the comments and make sure to subscribe to never miss a good TV show again. Number 10. They must really like your candy, too. What did you just say? Those men. They have lots of your candy in those boxes. Sweet Tooth is a fantasy drama television series created by Jim Mickle, bringing fresh air to the post-apocalyptic genre with creative ideas and effective tropes. This lonesome adventure is set in a world where a mysterious virus has wiped out most of humanity. But not only that, it caused the birth of part human, part animal babies that are now hunted by society and blamed as the cause of the world's crumble. Now young Gus, half deer, must survive in the wilderness without help. He's not gonna make it. Yes, he is. He has to. Do it, big man, faster! Come on, you can do it! Come on! You can do it! Come on, big man! Come on! Number nine. He's my partner. We're not partners. Well, we're friends slash partners. I wouldn't really describe us as friends. Hawkeye is an action crime superhero miniseries created by Jonathan Igla. Finally bringing the charismatic arrow shooter to his own screen, Hawkeye follows agent Clint Barton on a mission to not only save the world, but Christmas, when he is separated from his family over the holiday. Upon meeting a mysterious new young player in the game, he stumbles down a case of crime and gang wars that leads him right to a dangerous enemy. See, CB1 has trouble opening up. Uh, nobody calls me CB1. I'm just trying to know for a second. Probably some early childhood thing. He thinks he doesn't tell me much, but he ends up kind of... A virtual tower, it. nothing. Um, but yeah, I think it's because I'm generally just pretty chill. You know, I'm not like, oh my god, Hawkeye! <laughs> Number eight. The Empire does not tolerate failure, Sergeant. There were complications. Star Wars The Bad Batch is an animated action television series created by Dave Filoni. Inviting fans to a story that begins right in the middle of Order 66, we follow the gritty and twisted storytelling of past Clone Wars seasons, and this show introduces new characters. Genetically modified clone troops that have devoted their lives to a special mission with individual style and personalities. But as the dark forces take over and clones become killer machines, they find themselves in the eye of the storm. I warned you not to come back. Had to. We were looking for you. Me? What do you say, kid? You want to come with us? Or did we get captured for nothing? Number seven. Jabba had many vessels. We've got a lot of ground to cover if we are to keep his empire intact. The Book of Boba Fett is a science fiction action-adventure television series created by Jon Favreau and Dave Filoni. The legendary bounty hunter is back from the dead, and he is angry. Navigating the underworld of the galaxy with mercenary Fennec Shand, they return to the sands of Tatooine and stake their claim on the territory formerly ruled by the deceased crime lord Jabba the Hutt. Building upon the instant iconic hit The Mandalorian, this space tale expands on the Star Wars universe with more gritty and dirty action. Jabba ruled with fear. I intend to rule with respect. If I may. Speak freely. In difficult times, fear is a sure bet. Number six. I beg your pardon. On behalf of the Time Variance Authority, I hereby arrest you for crimes against the sacred timeline. Loki is a superhero adventure television series created by Michael Waldron. The universe's favorite villain is back and ready to conquer it. But first, he has to deal with the mysterious DVA, who presumably controls time itself to prevent chaos and anarchy with different timelines destroying everything we know. But with corruption and conspiracy at its heart, it is only a question of time till Loki figures out how to rule them too, sending him on a journey of literal self-discovery on the way. It's been a very long day. And I think I've had my fill of idiots in armored suits telling me what to do, so if you don't mind, this is actually your last chance. Now get out of my way. Number five. <laughs> Mushoku Tensei, Jobless Reincarnation, is a fantasy harem television series created by Rifujin Na Maganote. When you do the right thing, 
life might bring you a second chance. A nameless 34-year-old unemployed loner sees no sense in continuing with life anymore and dies while saving one of four teenagers standing in front of a truck. But when reincarnated as a baby in a world of sorcery and warriors, he makes something out of his new life and wants to become a master of sorcery. Number 4 to Your Eternity is a fantasy anime series created by Shinzo Fujita and Masahiko Murata. In this story, we follow an otherworldly being that is capable of changing its form from beings whose reflections it captures. Initially an emotionless stone, it gradually develops a self and personality as a result of interacting with animals and humans. After taking the form of a dying arctic wolf, it meets a lonesome boy who mistakes it for his pet wolf. But this is not the last fellow on its eternal journey through time. Number 3 Ranking of Kings is a coming-of-age fantasy anime series created by Taku Kishimoto, Megami Inoue, and Yosuke Hata. Defined by great world-building and mysteries, we follow a deaf, powerless prince who cannot even wield a children's sword. Driven by ambition and passion, he dreams of becoming the greatest and most powerful king ever, but behind his back, no one believes in him. Titled the good-for-nothing prince, he must face all doubts and odds to prove himself before the citizens of his kingdom. Number 2 It hit me. Go on. Hit me as hard as you can. Invincible is an adult animated superhero television series created by Robert Kirkman. Whoever thinks that the genre belongs to children should witness this hyper-violent, disturbing, and twisted approach to the material. Brought to you by a visionary mind, Invincible follows an ordinary teenager with an unordinary dad. He is the most powerful superhero on the planet. When he suddenly develops powers himself, he wants to become Earth's next great defender after his father, Nolan Grayson, also known as Omni-Man. Before we unveil TV show number one, here are some honorable mentions. What are you? Alina Starkov, assistant cartographer, Royal Corps of Surveyors. They're all gone. It's my fault. That's why I'm here, isn't it? Answer the question. This has nothing to do with us. Kip Faulkner was murdered. Murdered by whom? He's coming. Number one. Happy progress day! Arcane is an adult animated action fantasy television series created by Christian Link and Alex Ye. Based on the legendary international video game hit League of Legends and brought to life by infinite world building and expansion on our legend's famous stories, Arcane explores a conflict between sisters Vi and Jinx. On the opposite side of society and social class, they find themselves faced with a conflict that extends beyond technology and their two respective cities. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. If you want to know more about a particular TV show in this list, you can check out our links in the video description.
And for more top 10 TV show videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.